sejauh pegang anak pica. Ingat ni. Awe, anda jual ni, awe ni lah. Utara anda, utara lah, lah cipta. Ambil sini. Ali, nama le trap lagi. The lake actually is surrounded by uh, uh, a species, invasive species plant called uh, Prosophis, uh, which has really impacted on impact on the flamingos because once the lake has swelled beyond, then the inflows rivers are now outside, uh, are inside the Prosophis, which has resulted in uh, trapping some of the uh, flamingos, which, uh, which has caused uh, death uh, to flamingos. But this is something which is new. We've been having a normal mortality rate of the flamingos. This could be resulted in shortage of food. It can be sometimes maybe an, uh, an outbreak of a certain disease. But uh, this is something which is new. We've never experienced uh, a situation whereby the flamingos is being trapped by, by uh, this uh, invasive plant, the, the uh, prosovis. So this is something which is new. And we've experienced, we've seen. Uh, as a management, we've been doing a lot of clearance. But because of the legs uh, expanding every now and then, it, it has gone beyond where we, 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 we've done some clearance. So the population of flamingos in the River Lakes is declining because of increase in water levels within the lakes. Uh, the flamingos require shallow lakes, not deep lakes, deep water. Two, due to increase in water, it's providing unsuitable habitat for growth of algae. As water becomes fresh, the algae does not grow very well, which is food for the flamingos. Three, there's increased po pollution within these lakes, like Lake Nakuru, Lake, uh, Lake Naivasha, which comes from the surrounding settlements. Then four, as, in, as water is increasing, it's moving more inland, eh, terrestrial areas, which is uh, going to areas which have high vegetation, like uh, with areas which is invaded with matenge, which is an invasive species, which traps birds as they fly in and they, and they fly out. And this is evident within Lake Mongoria. <laughs> Top lane. So this one's in Lake Bogoria, which we're actually observing them dying in the lake because they're being caught up by Madenge. This is new, basically, to us, and we, we are still documenting it to see what's the impact of this uh, within this area. Like in, in, in Bogoria, we counted around three, three, four hundred birds caught up in Madenge, while we counted 400,000 lesser flamingo. So is it a big impact or not? It's, science will tell us as we continue analyzing the data. But also this other infrastructure being developed across the, the Rift Valley. This is not new. Birds are dying, colliding with power lines and colliding with other infrastructure that is coming up within the Rift Valley. And, and therefore this requires more dialogue and action or mitigation efforts being implemented as recommended by conservation people. Flying breeze. 
but uh, this is actually because of uh, this. Uh... Actually, one of the main challenge why we've say we've experienced the same uh, deaths of, 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 of the flamingos being trapped by this plant is because uh, the lake now has gone beyond the normal boundary. Our actual size of the lake is around 34, 34 kilometers, but as we speak now, it's over 42 kilometers square. We just now move beyond the normal boundary, which was actually considered. Uh, but nevertheless, there is a lot of breeders again, which is actually now uh, scavenging on, the, on this, uh, this uh, flamingos. We have the marabou stock, we have the African vishigo. So once the, the, the breeders fly over the, the, the flamingos, they start tendons of flamingos uh, being trying to secure themselves. But flying through the, the brosovis, now that's where the, where the big challenge. The other thing, because it has gone beyond the, the, uh, the, the boundary, there is a lot of scaring by the local people around. Because you move around the lake, the lake shore, which is uh, part of do's and do's in, 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 in our parks. Because flamingos have the right way of, of uh, uh, flying and they have the right way of living. So we are trying to, we have been having actually a series of community sanitization uh, on, on actually how they move along because now the flamingos are uh, beyond the, our, our area of, uh, of restriction.